Law Day is an event established by the American Bar Association to celebrate the rule of law. The idea is to bring kids and the public into your court and, and help to educate them on the rule of law. We had three activities in our, in our courthouse. And here in city council chambers, the children presented a proclamation to make May 6th Chinook Dragon Day, which is their mascot. They also went outside and toured a patrol vehicle and had a drone demonstration from the police department. Then in the courtroom, we did a mock trial based on Tinker versus Des Moines, which is a First Amendment case involving a student wearing a, a Vietnam War protest armband in violation of school policy. And then in the Riverton room, we had a legal jeopardy based on, we had uh, five different categories covering all of issues around rule of law. We hosted a total of 206 yep. kids, 100 in the morning and 100 in the afternoon, and then each, each group of 100 was divided into three groups of roughly 30, and they cycled through the three activities, so every kid did every activity. Well, what was really fun was that they were really, first of all, they were very excited to be here, which I was thinking, uh, field trip to the, community, to the local court, that doesn't sound very fun, but they were really into it. And in my courtroom, I sat with two student judges and they did all the judging and I, I gave them, we loaned them, lent them two robes and they were really owning the role. It was interesting because at first they were kind of sheepish and by their last remarks, they were very, the judge. It was, it was exciting to watch that transformation. And we also had a student clerk with our clerk um, who got to bang the gavel and I think had a good time doing that. What I tried to stress to the, to the students in, in our court, and I think when I was talking to them en masse, is this is your council chambers, that is your courtroom, and that is your conference room. We are your government. I mean, it's government of the people, by the people, for the people. Um, we can't all sit on the city council, but we can vote for city council and have our voices heard that way. And the importance of having your voice heard, tried to, I tried to um, let that guide everything that we were doing throughout the course of the day and to explicitly say that to the kids so they got that message. Mm -hmm.